so what's up guys another video welcome back to the channel and today i am going to be showing you guys how to create virtual cards boots nera and dollar cards using a lot by wema and also i'm going to be taking my time to show you guys like a total walkthrough of the app and what i think about the app if you should use it or not probably it's a scam or not so let's get into the video okay so first of all guys i would like you guys to go over to play store search the app you probably have the, the app already on your phone so you wouldn't need to do this so this is basically what we're going to be looking at on the app now stuff like that so this is what the app promises to give us accounts domiciliary accounts to some movie tickets um loans are available saving goals are available card yeah that's one of our main stuff virtual card so let's check it out if it's really working so i'm going to open the app now um for you if you're just getting it you, should, you can tap get started but um i'm going to be leaving a link to the app to where you can get the app in the description so you, you can check that out but I've, i already have an account so i'm going to basically just um, put in my password right now then sign up so i just put in my password now i'm logged in i hope you guys use the link in the description because basically you're going to get um free 1k if you use it so before wasting much time let me go um into the main stuff now you can see i have different account types here i'm going to explain those later and um first of all um, I know you guys are really anxious about this card stuff so basically I'm going to go into the cards now and I'm going to select my cards so as you can see um, this is basically to re request a physical card and there's one thing that comes with requesting a physical card you either get a um yeah you either get a verve card or a master card and you are going to get charged a fee of 1000 naira so basically i've not done this um i don't think i really need it since i can do everything i can do with my physical card with my virtual card so i don't think i need that that's why i haven't requested that the secret card here too but um you will not be able to get a credit card if you have not um imputed your details about how much you earn as your salary and stuff so that's why i am not able to get a credit card here so i'm going to go over to utility cards now and as you can see this here i should request a new card and this is it preferred name deposit of 2000 naira is required for cost cost inclusive and i don't absolutely want to get this one reason is because it's very and very practically you can see the provider here yeah, very practically um useless yes i can use that word because you can't really use it to pay for much online stuff so i'm going to go into um this one now a large virtual card so this is the one i use so basically you on your own part you just go over here i've already created mine that's why it's actually enter the pin but if it's you you can you will see a place where you can just create it yeah it's basically for free yeah just create the card then you can come and view your card details here just like mine and you'll be able to view your details whenever you want to um use it so um let me go over to the dollar card as well as you can see um the dollar card is still on maintenance i don't know why that is happening and the current date is november 29th as at the time i'm filming this video so hopefully they are done with this i actually created this um some time ago and it worked very well i, I was able to get the card but it cost about 1500 naira although i wasn't charged 1500 naira i just had to have at least 1500 naira in my alert wallet so i i did that i got the card but i couldn't fund it so i went over to play store 
I went to the play store and I dropped a bad review. Okay guys, I can't really see the review I dropped here because probably a lot of reviews are coming in too but I, in my review I basically told them that I was told them what happened to my dollar card and probably I wanted a refund back of my money stuff like that so I think that's what touched their heart and I actually got the money back it was refunded to my account and this dollar card ever since that time it was on maintenance or something like that so about topping up your nera card now so i'm gonna go enter my pin so this is what happens when you try to top up your nera card you are going to basically top up your nera card from one of your alert balance and um for you to transfer money to this your alert balance you just have to collect um copy this account number then you uh, paste it and select Wemar Bank as the bank then you see your name there so that, that that's all you need to do but um I'm trying to top up my Nera card now and if, as you can see for example 500 they say name required so name required name required so that's a very huge error and I don't know where it's coming from there's no space to fill in name or anything like that so you can't really top up your Nera card so I don't really see the point of having this Nera card unless you want to do a zero transaction online or, so, or a zero Nera transaction online so um let me know what you Continue. guys think about this, this channel on this my channel I post everything tech content it's also very, some app reviews and some money making too. ideas like that so I know you like that that's why you're actually watching this video and if you like that very much I would like you guys to subscribe hit the red button below help us reach our 1k subscriber mark and also hit that like button so more people can see this video and also gain from it too Um, basically my review for alert is that honestly you can't use it to get any credible virtual card unless you want to get this physical card that is going to be delivered to you and it's going to cost 1000 naira so basically that's the only um way you can get a card from alert so guys um basically apart from the virtual card um errors and all you can basically use alert to do every other thing including including purchasing airtime um paying bills these are stuff that i've actually tried and they are working perfectly so you shouldn't be worried about that and all even receiving money yes you can use that and also creating goals so you can do that too so those are the safe spots in alert spot you should stay away from is creating virtual cards any kind of virtual card because um your money will just go like that and you wouldn't be able to deposit into your card so another thing a lot also charges for like sending money like 10 era just to send money so um that is not free banking um in the next video i'll be um checking out another app that can get you virtual card both nera and dollar too and also be reviewing that app and some bad things in the app too and the good things in the app so if you don't want to miss that you know what to do subscribe and hit the bell so that when i drop it you can see it in your notification box up here so guys next time